He ad ambushes you on the Citadel when you try to go back to your ship. Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophase. I never thought I'd see the day. Uh -oh. agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Pack it out. I just know it. I said a hundred minutes. I meant to say an hour and like however many minutes. Commander. If it was a hundred minutes, my dazzle would stop recording. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. Because I can't get it going any higher. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. I'm glad we can help each other out. It's the only way we're going to defeat the Reapers. That much is certain. To that end, several Thrydock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. When the time comes to deploy it, the full measure Why did I say that? will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I don't even like that crap. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. More than dying, it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. I like I've done a few of those. Oh yeah, I forgot after every like major mission you have one of these dream sequences. I've got time left. I'm only at an hour and fifteen minutes. I got another forty minutes, forty five minutes, something like that. <laughs> Looks weird with the helmet off. Look at this shit. Weird, huh? Ink, people. Would have made me more accurate. Shadow people, which is an actual... Well, actual, actual. Allegedly actual paranormal phenomenon. There's this interesting video. It's just a audio done in the coast to coast radio show of Archbell talking about shadow people it's like two hours long pretty interesting pretty creepy too wrong guy I wasn't gonna say the word where the fuck are we other than in a dream where in hell did that little shit know? What did I tell you about playing with matches? Where the fuck were you sleeping? Oh, are these, are these, what the hell? I guess he fell asleep on his couch. I've actually seen this before. Usually they're in the bed. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? Thinking of some friends who aren't around, thanks In the middle of war. galactic genocide, how can this be a bad thanks time? to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? Caden, back on Burmire. He died. I don't miss Caden. I don't even give a shit about Caden. Or Ashley. Some might think his sacrifice was in vain. 
You know Caden would never think that. Yeah. That's one more reason I miss him. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. She called the comm room? The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. I always gotta bug my ass. The hero's work is never done. Until you're dead. Or retire. Then you gotta come out of retirement. Commander. Can I help you, Counselor? Shepard, I want you to understand that I owe my position to you. And it's not something that I take lightly. Were it not for you, that weak-minded Counselor Valon would still be alive. Leading the Solarians down the sewage pipe. But now I'm forced to champion a cure for the genophage. It's like saying we need a hurricane to put out a wildfire. What the hell? Counselor, Krogan are about to die in droves, so your people don't have to. That's your message. Human statesmanship at its finest. Speaking of, I need to talk to you about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. He's moving vast sums of money. We need to talk about where it's going. From what I can tell, you won't like the news. Okay. Next time you're on the Citadel. Issue out. Yeah, we're going to the Citadel next time. Alright, let's talk to these assholes. Why the hell not? Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? I won't lie, Shepard. You want to call me a sir. Things aren't looking good in most sectors. We need to increase the tempo and chalk up some wins, otherwise. This won't end well for the human race. Or any race any that's race. alive currently. In this galaxy. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Heard not Rex running the show is a bonus for us. Had that female Krogan you rescued survived, she might have rallied more support from the clans, but I'll take what we can get. Well, I'm glad you decided uh. that mom and Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support as it is. We picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. Uh, whoa, what the hell? How about the Solarians? Is that coming? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. That's always the good. STG guys know the score. They're not going to jeopardize the entire Solarian Union just because some Delatraz didn't get her way. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful and violent. Mostly Vorchai I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Darner Vosk is bringing his men and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Tch. <laughs> not Rex has deployed troops. They got a bigger bow. That's why. Pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. What about the Astari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thestia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yog homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yog has teeth. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten. <laughs> Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogans sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Irum. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance. They got what they had coming. Straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. Nothing more, sir. 
from what I've heard about the Yarg, they're as advanced as that we are now in modern times, so... I think I've said this before, but I don't think it'll take them 50,000 years to become spacefaring. Unless they have to find... Reaper technology. Maybe take thousands of years just to use their technology to find the relays. I don't know, it's game logic. Your logic is flawed. Now they made a mission. The Turians have given us top level access to their combat data. Their ships are already moving in to help the Alliance fleet. You actually secured a Krogan Turian Alliance. It's one thing to hear about Commander Shepard, it's another to see him in action. Commander Shepard, doing the impossible. Commander? Uh, what was I gonna say? Fuck. Other than people are way too without in this house. Uh. Yeah, with that I record to one hour and twenty-four minutes, but really. Alright, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start of combat? Um, I give up. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Alright, big guy. What do you call it when a courier gets killed by a horrible spike monster? Friendly fire. Oh, come on, that one goes back to Shang-Chi. How you gotta respect the classics? How many humans does it take to activate a dormant mass relay? 602. 600 to vote on it, one to ask to be sorry for technical help, and one to request a seat on the council afterwards. How do you know when a Turian's out of ammo? He switches to the stick up his ass as a backup weapon. Why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? You're shitting me! The Turian military has one about me? Oh, absolutely. I heard it myself from a private back on Palavin. All right, why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? So their Marines can beat someone in hand-to-hand -hand drills. <laughs> Damn, you need to tell James that one. Hey, what's the hardest part about treating a Turian who took a rocket to one side of his face? Figuring out which side took the rocket. You people. <laughs> Never thought I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. Why did he get shorter all of a sudden? I'm sorry about Morden. He was a good man. Yeah, he was always running those tests. And one time he tagged me in the middle of the night to ask how many livers humans had. And this bump on my elbow? He said it was just a mild bone deformation, but I'm pretty sure he stuck a probe in there. Glad it was just your elbow. I always thought he was crazy. Useful. But crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? <laughs> I guess not. But he was one of ours. So now that we got the Krogan and the Turian, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? Works for me. So how does it feel knowing Krogan will be singing songs about you until the end of time? I think it would be an honor. There's enough misery in this universe. Ha! <laughs> His scars are healing. Ha! Something go right for a change. Because all the Paragon. They witnessed history in the making like this. Decisions. Well, except for Sovereign attacking the Citadel, and then there was the Collector base, but this one felt good. And let's hope Rex keeps running the show on Tachumka. Maybe we should hire a food taster for him. Imagine the carnage if some young, hot-headed Krogan took over. It could happen. I know. It's a chance we have to take. But I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have taken that Salarian deal. I could never bring myself to do that, no matter what I was offered. I admire you. That's our slain renegade. It's nice when we can save the galaxy without destroying another race along the way. What, they don't have Wikipedia? They can just... Let's hope our luck holds. Warren just gonna look it up. I wonder where all the Krogan will live now. I've never seen what you'd call a house on Tachanka. I wonder where all the Krogan will live no. now. I've never seen Commander.